Good morning and welcome to 7.30 a.m. On Monday at my boyfriend's place, I'm gonna do a bit of work in the office today. I'm a bit chilly, so I've just got out of bed and put some extra layers on. I he's making me coffee at the moment. That's nice, isn't it? It's about 10 to eight now, I've got coffee. Look, my boyfriend's made me some coffee. I'm gonna start work on tonight's vlog. It's nearly done, actually. Then uh, after that, I need to consult my diary. I've got a few different band emails that I need to deal with to do with bookings that have been coming in. We're kind of getting a little bit of a flutter for the beginning of January which is normal I would say. I would do you a lovely shot of outdoors but it's basically dark so I won't. Half past eight it is now light and uh, we can actually see out of the window. <laughs> About to do my thumbnail now and uh, that that you can hear. It's Portuguese TV streaming live. I really struggle to fit my language learning into my day, but what I do do is stream live Portuguese telly when I'm doing things like making graphics, you know, for thumbnails and stuff like that. So I find I can, I can kind of take it in all right and it doesn't distract me too much. But if I was like writing text or something like that, no, I have to turn it off then. I needed more coffee. Urgently. <laughs> we had a bit of a late night last night because we went and played music with my dad and didn't get back until half 12, something like that. I'm getting caught vlogging again. Whenever I get my camera out, Di comes in. Hi, Di. <laughs> He's waving. Right, I'm gonna go back and uh, make my thumbnail. It's about 10 past nine now, I'm on to my emails. I've got several to do with various bands. Okay, don't need to reply to that one, good. Right, this one next. This one's a lengthy one with a lot of different points on different subject matters. I'm literally having to take notes in numbers so I can form my answers properly. And I think I'm gonna to have to consult different band members about stuff as well to get this one answered. <laughs> Not as straightforward as the last one. The last one was just like, okay, read that, that's fine. It's 10.43 and I'm hungry, so I've just got myself some breakfast. So I've been dealing with four different inquiries for one band. One for January, one for April, one for June, and one for August. And the personnel are kind of varying depending on who's available, so it's all got a bit confusing. But anyway, I've been taking copious notes and I need to put them into my spreadsheet tomorrow, probably, um, because I'm gonna need to crack on, need to get my vlog up and get showered, breakfasted, and go and work in the office here. 11.10 and it's time for a shower and get dressed. I'm showered, I'm dressed, I'm breakfasted, and I'm ready to go and start in the office over there in the outbuilding. We've had a jump forward in time, look, quarter to two. We're both microwaving leftovers. Well, I'm microwaving my leftovers at the moment. It's the rest of that tofu stroganoff I made the other day and he's got chicken curry left over in the fridge. So we're both like having something quite similar, but different. He's gonna clock off in a minute, I think. I have been informed that we're going shopping later this evening as well because he's run out of stuff. He needed to go yesterday, really, but we didn't quite get around to it. I feel like I do nothing but go food shopping at the moment. Oh my gosh, I've had a little fork full. I thought it might be a bit bland because there was rather a lot of rice to sauce ratio, but actually it's really nice. I'm gonna enjoy this now. It's six o'clock. We've just come up from the office. We've finished for the day. I mean, we haven't finished. We're gonna to have to carry on tomorrow. I'm gonna to have her second day of it. Um, I've just noticed in the monitor, my camera. I've got the wrong glasses on so I've had to call down to IP and he's had to go and unlock the office again and go and get my my normal glasses because these are my reading glasses. Anyway, in order to have dinner we can just go out. <laughs> so we're gonna go shopping and get chips on the way back. I think that is the plan. Oh no, not chips, no. Maybe we're gonna like get one of those, I don't know, Indian takeaway meals for two but from the supermarket and then heat it up and you get in, you know, that sort of thing. I'm rambling on, I it's been a long day. I'm tired for an Aldi. This is a bit more fun than working in the office, isn't it? IB is choosing some meat for himself currently. Did I say we were in an Aldi? I think I did. And it's a new one. Actually, I'm on a Marmite substitute mission. I'm looking for it now. Now you see my friend Claire, who watches the vlogs. We went to college together. She plays sax and she's very cool. Hi, Claire. Now she said that Aldi do an own brand of Marmite and she said it's very good and it tastes a lot like Marmite and I should try it. So I'm hunting for it right now. Hmm, this looks like the right sort of place, doesn't it? It spreads. No, it's not there. Well, I'll keep my eyes peeled for it. Now, IB and I were discussing in the car. I pointed out if we got a ready meal for two, he'd have to have vegetarian or pescatarian. So I said, why don't we get separate? So then you can have a big old meaty munch, can't you? And he said, oh yeah, that's a point. So that's what we're doing. IB's chosen this for me and I fancy that. What's he got himself? Chicken tikka masala. There we are. We're going to cook rice at home. It's going to be double rice portions for us today. Actually, we're having rice tomorrow for lunch as well. Well, they sell wool in Aldi as well. I was looking at this in Trago Mills the other day. Six ninety nine and four ninety nine. Hey, I'm going to break with my tradition tomorrow, and I'm not going to have corn cakes for breakfast. Look, thirty nine p for six crumpets. So that's going to do me tomorrow morning. Ooh, look what we got. 
Mint Mighty Yeast Extract. How much is it? £1.89. Right, I'm passing that up to Ivy. He's going to have one as well, so Claire. Hope you were right. <laughs> the pressure's on. <laughs> I'm just having an idea about having this instead of the rice. Stone baked garlic pizza bread. Look, my hand is going towards the. <gasps> my hand is open in the door, IB. It's grabbing it. It says ready to share. Oh, it's not very really big, mind. I'm just getting a bit riced out, to be honest. I love rice, but I'm going to be having it tomorrow as well because we took something out of the freezer that has rice in for lunch. These pizzas are very good value. IB is selecting one for his freezer. £2.59, look, for eight cheese. Eight cheese, pepperoni and honey. Oh, I don't think I'd fancy honey on a pizza. Mmm, hash browns. I like hash browns, actually. £1.69 for all those. Somebody's abandoned their shopping. I wonder if they're coming back. They've got tuna steaks, look. Yeah, grab some of those. Shall I get some? Yeah, Izzy loves these. Not that Izzy ever... Well, hardly ever comes to your place. So how much is it for that? £3.19 for a packet of four. That is such good value, isn't it? Very nutritious. Ugh. If I had an Aldi near me, I would definitely shop at it a lot. I'm going to grab a tin of mandarins, actually. I had one of these recently with some custard and meringue nest and stuff, and it was just gorgeous. Um, I might have some with just natural yoghurt or something tomorrow. Right, time to take the trolley back. These ones have coins in. I was wondering if they would or not because you know some shops do some shops don't back we go then we are back the oven is on for that garlic and cheese pizza bread mm, i'm pretty hungry by this point that pizza is looking very tasty right now and smelling pretty good too oh it's here and it's smelling amazing hello it's about 10 to 9 now we enjoyed our dinner i burnt the roof of my mouth on it it's now blistering I think, <laughs> but it was a very tasty meal. I want to say thank you to Tamsin K for making a donation to the channel through the buy me a coffee link thingy. I really appreciate that. Thank you so, so much. I need to go and edit this video now. If you happen to like it, could you please give it a like? It really helps the channel to grow. If you're new here and you would like to watch more videos from me, do feel free to hit the subscribe button down there and the notification bell. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.